Hello, my name is Avril Townsend and welcome to the TNT Teaching and Learning YouTube channel. In this video, I will talk to you about questioning technique known as wait time. Wait time is the amount of time that you wait from asking a student a question in class. In a study, it's been found that most teachers only allow one second or less for a student to respond to a question. And it's also been found that students that are weaker are actually given a less wait time than students are more capable. This amount of wait time is not sufficient, particularly for those students that are weaker who might struggle with a response. Students, uh, studies have found that a wait time of three seconds is most effective for lower order questions. For higher order questions, there's no limit to how long you should wait so with obviously you need to wait within reason depending on the length of the question and the, and the style of the question it's important to wait give a sufficient wait time because a good wait time will improve the student's outcomes and their responses so some examples of how it might help the student is that it will give improved performance it will increase retention increase the student's confidence, you'll get a much higher number of responses, less interruptions, and it will increase the student-to-student -student interactions. If you've enjoyed this video, please click the like button at the bottom. And if you would like to subscribe um, for more updates and more teaching and learning videos, then please subscribe. 